yeah, no. Definitely can't wear this for the whole video. Nope. Hi, I'm Andy, and I am doing the Ruler of Books book tag. It's really self-explanatory, so let's just jump right in. First up, what book would you declare everyone must read? And I'm gonna take a little bit of a cop out here and go with the series, being The Lunar Chronicles by Marissa Meyer. Cinder is book one in this series, and it's honestly just great. It's my favorite series I have ever read, and I feel like it would be a fair choice for my kingdom because it has a little bit of something for everyone. There's sci-fi, there's romance, there's fairy tale, there's action, there's adventure. I think that everybody should read this because they're amazing books and just why? Why haven't you read them, crazy person? Pick this up. Number two, what would you abolish from book construction? And that is these weird uneven pages. I don't know how you can see that. These kind of pages that just flick like that, I hate it. Just have normal paper. Number three, what author would you commission to write everything? And as an aspiring author, I'm going to pick myself. Just kidding, I'm supposed to be the ruler of books, not the dictator of books. So I'm going to choose Holly Black. I have been dancing around Holly Black for years. I always see her books in the store and I've kind of just never picked one up. And I finally read uh, The Colts Girl in Cold Town. This is the first Holly Black book I read. And she's awesome. I love that she's not afraid to make nice stories that also get really dark. So yeah, Holly Black, you do you. Come write all the books in my kingdom. Also, she produces books on the regular. She's not one of those authors where we wait forever for her next book. So I feel like I can actually rely on her, which I appreciate. Number four, which book would you demote to the basement in order to make room for new books? Now I'd like to clarify here, it says demote to the basement, not like burn or destroy, so don't hate me too much, but I'm demoting The Host by Stephanie Meyer. I have tried so many times to finish this book and I just can't do it. I can't finish this book, but I refuse to get rid of it because it's like a personal challenge at this point. But yeah, might as well move it to the basement for new books because Lord knows when I'm going to finish reading this thing. Next step, which cover artist would you commission to paint a mural in your kingdom? And for that, I am going to go with the person who did the cover for She Rises. I think that Holly McDonald did a beautiful job with this. It's a book that I bought straight up for the cover. It's part of my 2016 reading challenge to read a book solely based off the cover. So with that in mind, how could I not pick Holly McDonald for this? Bonus for her, I really appreciate it when the spine is pretty because that's the part that sits on your shelf and everyone can actually see. Number six, which character do you think should appear on a coin? And for that, I am of course going with Percy Jackson. Not only is Percy just generally awesome, but he totally deserves to be on a coin. He's a freaking hero. Though I do believe that Percy would be really embarrassed and self-conscious about appearing on a coin, but like, Percy, you deserve it. Just take the compliment. And last up, what book do you want to give the yearly award to? And for that, I'm again going to cheat a little bit, just bookending the video with cheating. And I'm going to go with Saga. This is volume three, but all of them can win the award. All of them can win all of the awards. I mentioned in my spring reading wrap up that I finally read Saga and I am so much on the bandwagon for this. They're amazing. You should read them. They absolutely win the award of like coolest thing to exist ever. <laughs> Well, okay, I mean, maybe not ever. Probably coolest things ever are like, you know, penicillin. But book-wise, Saga's excellent. Ignore that, you read it. <laughs> and there you are, my lovely subjects. That is my decree as the ruler of books. I hope you enjoyed, and I will see you next time.